This ThinkPad T420 is a 14-inch laptop that was launched in 2011 with Intel's second-generation core processors. Despite its age, this model still has many loyal fans who use it as their main computer. But why would someone use an old computer like this in 2024? One reason the T420 is popular is because of the upgradability. This one has an upgraded quad-core CPU, 16 gigabytes of RAM, an IPS 1080p screen, and an MSATA SSD, which allows a hard drive to be used as extra storage. So while this ThinkPad does run Linux, it doesn't have to in order to function, it can run Windows 11 smoothly as well although it isn't officially supported. Basic daily tasks are still decently snappy and has no problem watching videos at its full 1080p resolution. This model also has the NVIDIA NVS 4200M, so it can play some games all right as well, such as the recently updated Counter-Strike 2 at lower settings and some other older games as well. Just keep in mind, that not all of the ThinkPad T420s will come with this GPU, so don't expect to be able to game on every T420. Also, this GPU only has one gigabyte of video RAM and is not very powerful, even compared to other laptop GPUs at the time, so you should not expect much in the gaming department. Unless, of course, you use the Express card slot and an external PCIe adapter to use an external desktop GPU. However, the biggest issue with this is that you will be bottlenecked by the slower data transfer rate. With all the upgrades considered, the price to performance ratio is not the best value for the money. You could get a ThinkPad T480 and have a faster and more energy efficient i58250U compared to the i72720QM the T480 also isn't bottlenecked by the slower DDR3 RAM of the T420. Although, this comparison isn't really relevant to the T420, as it's almost never used for gaming. The ThinkPad T420 is still an awesome machine, and some people may still prefer it over the T480. While other computers may be faster, this one has more than enough performance to run Linux. It's not just about running Linux, it's about running Linux with style and class. The T420 has a style that mimics the original ThinkPad design. Although it's not quite the same, it was one of the newest models of ThinkPads you could get with the classic seven row keyboard and of course, that blue enter key. There was also the ThinkPad T470 25th year anniversary edition although they are kind of rare and expensive and only came with weak dual-core processors. Some people who want the black brick design but don't mind the newer keyboard might have gotten a one-year newer ThinkPad T430, which has the nice advantage of faster USB 3.0 ports. There is also the ThinkPad T520, which is nearly identical to the T420, except it's wider. The proportions of this one are just right. It's not so big that it's cumbersome, but it has enough thickness to feel sturdy and high quality, yet is also more functional than the X series ThinkPads because it has a CD drive and a bigger screen. Also, the X series does not have an upgradable CPU. As for the ability to upgrade, the T420 is pretty easy to work on but it's not too easy to work on. Getting to things like the CPU and the second slot of RAM takes a few more extra steps than some other computers, but the extra bit of work makes it more satisfying to complete the job, so it's fun to tinker with. There is also a way to upgrade the CPU to a third generation Intel Ivy Bridge CPU, although I have to modify the BIOS with Core Boot for it to work. This whole video, I've been dancing around the question, why the T420? Why would I use this computer in 2024? Aside from the expansion options that many modern computers lack, 
such as the full size SD card slot, the Wi Fi kill switch, eSATA port, display port, and VGA port. I can't think of any logical or practical reason why I would use this computer. The reason why I opt to use this specific model is simply because I like it. I think it looks cool. I like the way it clicks, the way it beeps when it sleeps, and the flickering green light that always lets me know exactly when the drive is being used. It's the little redundant touches, like these that make for the perfect combination of retro styling and modern usability. The T420 is not for everyone, but for some, this machine does everything they need it to do, and that's good enough. Thanks for watching this video, and I hope you have a good evening. Thank <laughs> you.